Hey guys, welcome back. This is Outer Orange with Life is Strange, part um, episode 5, part 3. We are probably about halfway through the episode. Let's keep on going. My thing keeps uh, got rudely interrupted again. I'm trying my best to at least have an outro before I leave you guys, but uh, I'm probably going to extend my time limit once more just to make it a little easier. But anyway, let's keep going. striking us down and I'm the one trapped in this fucking radio station somebody get me the hell out of here now now god damn it how do I pay all those taxes she can drive or she just didn't have her own car I guess that makes more sense you have one new message message received yesterday at 9pm Max it's Nathan I, I just wanted to say I'm sorry. I didn't want to hurt Kate or Rachel or, or I didn't want to hurt anybody. Everybody used me. <laughs> Mr. Jefferson is coming for me now. All this shit be over soon. Watch out, Max. He wants to hurt you next. <laughs> sorry. Alyssa needs help again. Help me get down, Matt. I'm stuck up here. Alyssa. Please! Help me get down! Alyssa, are you okay? Let me help you down. Help that shit, Matt. Whatever you show up, I have to get out of the way. about all those children out there.
looks like the diner, though. No, you're not dead! You're not! Okay, so I don't think- I think I'm fine. I think I can go through here. There's two photo ops here. Oh, I think here's one. Of them. to stop him from getting hurt. Okay. Um, I think it should be fine to go in here, but I don't know. This isn't... How can I get out of here? Makes me so sad. He's dead, electrocuted. Right now. I need to breathe. Uh, I need air. No more storms. Oh, you should get out now. of here. The whole town is dying. Okay. I better hurry to the diner over there. I need Warren's photo. There's a, that car right there is a photo op, and that whale right there is a photo op. But um, right now, it's not letting me do anything about it. So let me see if maybe I can. I have to stop this first before. No need to go there now. Okay. How do I stop the explosion? So number four, which is right over here. The bar. Once you go in the diner though, you lose your chance to take these photos. Do it.
evacuation. That was three Once four, again, by the way. This is not a test. This is not a test. An E6 tornado warning has been issued for Arcadia Bay Max. and surrounding counties. The emergency broadcast system oh, is now Max. in effect. Oh, Jesus, I am so glad to see you, sweetie. Are you okay? Yes. What about you guys? The two whales is barely standing now. I don't know if it's gonna make it through this tornado. Oh, poor Officer Barry and all those people out there. I know. There. Okay, get your ass inside. I have to get back to this gentleman on the ground. Lauren has been gathering all the first aid. It's not much, Joyce, but it's all we have. You okay, Warren? How the hell did I ignore all those warnings, Max? The snow? The eclipse? There's nothing you could do about it, Warren. I'm so stupid. Should have seen it coming. Hey, I like his shirt. <laughs> so no. glad everybody is safe here. <laughs> but... Okay, Max. Excuse me while I go help this other gentleman. Frank. I'm so glad you're here. Are you okay? What? Besides this tornado, the hole in my leg, not to mention the fact that I might die on the floor of a diner, and you're the last person I could see. You know what? I'm cool. Jesus. And I bet that thief Chloe and you didn't find Rachel. Right? Oh, Frank. I don't know how to say this, so... I just will. Rachel is dead. Fuck you, Max. No. No way. She left town. She's gone. Now, how do you know, huh? How? All of our clues led us to my professor, Mark Jefferson. He had this creepy photo torture chamber. And we found out he was using Nathan Prescott to drug and photograph Blackwell students. Prescott? Fuck! Fuck! I knew it! I should never have hooked up with that sick punk. Papadou hated him. Yeah. Papadou? You saw... You saw Rachel. Yes. I wish I didn't. I'm so, so sorry, Frank. Nathan wanted to impress Jefferson, and he... He killed her. How? Hmm. How did he kill her? He used some drug and gave her an overdose. An Jeez. overdose? The only way Nathan could have done that is, is if I sold it to him. I killed my lioness. No. Uh, no. What have I done? Where is this motherfucker Jefferson? He's going to jail. He won't be hurting anybody anymore. Rachel. Oh, God. She was the one good thing in my life, Max. I know she was too young. I expect her to leave me, just... It's not how it happened. I would never have stopped her from going after her dreams. I know. She obviously cared about you, Frank. You know, Rachel cared about a lot of people. Especially Chloe. But, uh... Now I see why Rachel dug her. And Chloe was man enough to ask me for help after all that shit we went through. Chloe would appreciate that. You know, the one time I met my dad, the bastard quoted the Bible and said he wanted to enter his house justified. Hmm. In other words, to do the right thing. Me too. And maybe you're helping me get there, Max. Aww. Don't get me wrong, kid. I still think you're weird. But you're cool. Please be okay, Chloe. I can't lose you. Good job, Warren. I hope those supplies are enough. Jeez. Speak to him. I hate to say I'm glad to see you. I'm so glad to see you. That's okay. The important thing is that you're safe. And I know you can take care of yourself after Nathan. You should have done that a long time ago. But damn, Max. I can't believe you actually drove down here in the middle of a fucking E6 tornado. 
Just for one photograph? I mean, I know you didn't come for me. Warren, huh? I came for all of you. Just tell me you do have the photograph. I just want... Now shut up and listen. Oh yeah, you're finally going to tell me what you never did in the parking lot. I wish I would have. So I'm just going to tell you without any explanation. Trust me, okay? I always do. You should probably tell me quick. I had a vision in Jefferson's class of a tornado destroying Arcadia Bay. I went to the bathroom and saw my best friend Chloe get shot by Nathan Prescott. You with me so far? Where else could I be? Go on. Then I found out that I could rewind time. And long story short, Mark Jefferson is insane and dangerous. Whoa. Is that all? I have to go back in time. Jefferson already k killed Chloe. I can't let that happen. Well, I have I to like do something, talking. Warren. Max, going back in time is what caused the storm. All because... because of me? She's How? Like speaking. I'm not a real scientist, even though I play one at school, but... This seems like pure cause and effect. Maybe chaos theory. <sighs> what happened with Jefferson? Did, did he hurt you? He used Nathan to get drugs and money for him. Jefferson tied me up and dosed oh, me with some glitch. drug and took sick photos of me. <sighs> it was so horrible. Max. I'm so sorry you had to go See, through he all talks that. Normally. You're the bravest person I've ever known. You know, I want to kill that son of a bitch. Where is he? Busted. History. Here. Which I need to change fast to make it right again. Is that bad? For every action, there's there's a reaction. Whenever you reverse or or alter time, maybe you cause a chain reaction. Even in the environment. Maybe. You're my friend, Warren. You believe me, right? I I haven't told anybody else except for Chloe, and and she can't help me right now. I know I can be a pain in the ass, and and you've always treated me like a person. Not, not a beta nerd. I I told you before that I'll always believe you. I just wish I could trust my powers. I guess we'll never know if it's magic or science. Even if it's from a wizard or a wormhole, you're part of something bigger. And I don't believe in fate or destiny, but after this week, I realize I don't know shit. That makes both of us, Warren. I do know you're here for a reason. And I guess it's up to you to find out why. Max, I'm sorry you got stuck in this. In this, I don't have a fucking clue what's going on. But I have total faith that you'll do the right thing when the time comes. I'm so proud of you, Max. Yeah, How could there photo. be a more important moment in history? And I'm in the middle of it with you? So thank you for trusting me. Thanks for being here. Always. Oh, jeez. Okay. Max. Hey. Be careful out there. Oh man, I don't know. Should I do it? Should I ship him? If, my, if one of my friends is watching this, she's gonna be like, No! Why would you do that? I'm doing it. Do it. Do it. For luck. Oh. Bo. Just in case we don't get out of this, I wanted to say... I know, Lauren. <laughs> you like me. Of course you do. <laughs> I'm going to make the right choices from now on. I swear. That's why you're super max. That was a hard choice. I actually kind of wanted them more to hug after I can't everything. I to escape the two whales. I won't even lie.
This is so awkward to do, I don't think you guys understand. Like, it's like you I'm literally just moving around the analog sticks, hoping for the best. Uh, there we go. Action. We got no time for this shit. Come on, Max. Ugh. Chloe! Jesus, dude, what is up with you? I'm just glad we're here together. I guess you need to talk. No worries. It's all good. I'm glad you're with me, too. What's going on, Max? We have to find Nathan right now. He's gonna sorry, be more we're in. to Rachel. Let's go, now. Chloe, wait, listen. I can walk and listen, okay? Stop and listen for once. Fine, Max. I'm listening. Chloe, you can't go in that party. You're going to... You're going to die if you do. You used your powers, right? And you fucked around with time and I died. Not like that. You're supposed to back me up. So there's no way that punk-ass bitch Nathan Prescott is taking me down. You're right, he won't. Mark Jefferson killed you. And others. Jefferson, the art teacher? That's bullshit! Nathan is the fucking serial killer! We saw the proof! Now excuse me, I'm going to that party to make sure he never hurts anybody again. Are you coming? Is she like retarded? Nathan is dead, and you're in danger. That fucker is already dead? How do you know that? Because I was there. Will you please tell me exactly what happened? Please. Jefferson kidnapped Rachel and some other girls. He was also manipulating Nathan, and he killed him. Then it's Jefferson's turn to die now. I understand why you don't want to do this, and I won't blame you for not coming with me. Chloe! If I'm totally strong and honest, she'll listen. I'm her best friend. Nathan is dead. That... Because... Will you please tell me... Mark Jefferson turned out to be a psychopath. Okay, Max. Let's go in there as a team and take his ass out right now. Chloe. Jefferson drugged and kidnapped me. I was tied up in his bunker. You have no idea what hell I went through to get back here. But I couldn't let you die. You brought me back here, and I can't lose you again. I won't. Um, Max, I'm... I'm so sorry. I was the one who dragged you into all this shit. Nobody, especially you, should have to go through that. I... Now we have to stop Jefferson. With one bullet. No. Not this way. Chloe, I, I can't keep fixing everything if all I'm gonna do is just break it over and over again. I know how this is gonna turn out, and I'm afraid I'm fucking up all these alternate realities. Wait, alternate realities? What do you mean, Max? What did you do? I fucked up, Chloe. I wanted to make things right, but everything turned out wrong. Max, what the hell are you talking about? I, I was able to go back in time to the last day William was alive. I stopped him from leaving, but... But you ended up in a car crash instead. You saw my dad again? You... You were completely paralyzed. And you, you were in pain. You were slowly dying, and you... You asked me to end your life. And I did. For you, I... I didn't want you to suffer in any other timeline or reality. I, I couldn't bear the thought of you in any more pain. God, Max. That must have been... That must have been awful for you. I, I'm so sorry I had to ask you that. It was worse for you. But I had no idea what would happen, and as usual, I messed everything up, and... <sighs> I never want to hurt you. Ever. You have to believe me. Of course I do. 
Do you think I would even know how to handle that situation? Nobody would. The important thing is that we're together again. You're right. Mm. That's, that's why you should come with me, so we can stay together and stay alive. I hear you, Max, but do you think we should let Jefferson get away with torture and murder? Of course not. If we tell David, he'll believe us and he can actually stop him. Right? I don't get it. Why do you trust him after you totally reamed him the other day? He's not even at our house anymore. Chloe, David saved me from Jefferson. If he didn't track down the dark room, I'd be dead right now. Max, I had no clue. I should have been the one to save you, but I'm so grateful David was there. So what's your plan? We tell him everything, including that Victoria is in danger. Okay. You've been through so much. I, I believe you, Max. After all, I'm still your faithful companion. Yes, you are. So listen, in a few minutes, I won't know any of this happened. Nothing. We absolutely have to stay in your room and do nothing. Then we explain everything to David, and we finally let him do his job. You'll have to tell me exactly what I did and said just now. Just explain that I traveled through time using the photo. Will you believe me? I'll always believe you, Chloe. together. Oh! oh! Chloe! I see that the real Max is back. So, how was your time trip, dude? Shut up! Oh, you're alive! You're alive! Oh, both of us! I did so much to bring you back, Chloe. It worked! Actually, it worked! You're with me again! Looks like even fate doesn't want us apart. And I travel through multiple realities just to save my ungrateful ass over and over and... I hope it was worth it, but... I don't blame you for wanting me out of your life after all my drama. Come on. I'm the official drama king and queen of Arcadia Bay this week. Just look at what my powers have caused in just a short time. Nobody. You're Max fucking Caulfield, time warrior. Even if you weren't, you're kind and caring. Nobody could have a better best friend. Nobody. You didn't ask for any of this to happen, but it did. You need to- I have to stop right here. Um, I'm about to end my time. Uh, thank you guys for watching. We'll see you guys in the next part. This has been Outer Orange with Life is Strange, episode 5, part, I believe we're on- this was 3, so we're on 4. Alright, see you in the next one.